When working with snippets in VS Code, you can use Tab and Shift Tab to navigate through snippet placeholders. In this TypeScript file, for example, I'm going to go trigger the class snippet just by typing out class and then selecting the snippet from the suggestion list here. And you can see that this snippet has two placeholders, so the one that my cur cursor is currently on for the class name, and then one for the constructor parameters below. So let's say I start filling this in, and when I'm done filling in the first placeholder, I can just hit Tab to move on to the next one and I can fill that one in as well. And if there are other placeholders, I could then hit tab to move on to those. Now, let's say that I'm filling in this one and I notice that I've made a mistake and I actually wanna go back to the previous placeholder. For this, I can actually just hit shift tab and I can navigate back and now change this. So I can use tab to move forward and then shift tab to move backwards through the placeholders. And then once I'm done, I end up at the final position here and my uh, snippet has been completed. Now this is really helpful on more complex snippets. So let's actually go and take a look at the for loop snippet here. And you can see that this one actually uses a single placeholder to um, fill in values at multiple places within the resulting snippet. So there's a placeholder for index. And if I type I here, you can see that I is updated in multiple locations. Now if I hit tab, I'm changing the value of array here. So I can do array. But let's say I actually wanna change I at this point. For that, I can just go back and hit shift tab again. And now I can go and change this to G or whatever. And it has updated that placeholder value in all the places in the snippet where it was actually being used. So that's how you can use tab and shift tab to navigate through snippet placeholders in VS Code.